Missy Bauer with B&M Crop Consulting. We're here in the shop today talking about our 10-point planner checklist. Today we're talking about number three, the down pressure system. So what are we trying to accomplish with our down pressure system on the planter? This is really, really critical when we head out to the field itself. So the job of your down pressure system, whether you're running springs or airbags or hydraulic, is to help keep this row unit in the ground. If we don't have adequate down pressure, what happens is the row unit itself is going to start to ride out of the ground and we'll lose our uniformity of planting depth. So you're set to plant two inches deep and all of a sudden we keep finding a bunch of seed at an inch and a half, let's say. Those are what we call floaters because this row unit keeps riding up out of the ground. So this really depends on what type of soil conditions you're in, the type of tillage you're in, uh, what your seed bed overall condition is like, because remember this planter will feel what's ever underneath it. So adequate down pressure is really critical. As far as the systems, as I mentioned, there's the spring system, airbags, hydraulic. By far, as we add dollars with each one of those components, we have agronomically seen the big advantages. So springs a lot of times in the field, just have a real tough trouble trying to hold consistent down pressure. They kind of act like a, like a true spring out there and it's just moving. So if I'm trying to hold X pounds of down pressure as I'm going across that field, uh, the spring just doesn't have the ability to hold that consistent very well. The airbags were most certainly an improvement over that. But as we move to hydraulic, it even got better. So this particular planter has a hydraulic uh, downforce system on it. This one has to be delta, happens to be delta force from precision planning. But the hydraulic is very quick. So this type of down pressure tied into the sensors. We have a sensor on here to help uh, determine the, the load that we have there and making adjustments on the go. But that type of a system tied with the sensor, so it's a truly automated system, has really been impressive in the field as far as agronomically, what we can do with the microenvironment around the seed and actually being able to hold these row units in the ground as we go, off, go across a variety of conditions. So you want some more information on things to look at on your down pressure system, we really encourage you to check out our full video series of the 10 point planner checklist that's available here online on limited views. We also got some special discount codes, so take a look at the link below and check out what we have there today.